Welcome, Brainers. Did you notice? My taskbar is not showing all the icons. Of course, there's a placeholder for each, but they are not just visible. There could be another case where the entire taskbar is hidden. If you're facing any such issues, you've landed at the right place. Let's go ahead and fix it. Solution 1 Quick Fixes Let's start with the case where you see the taskbar, but some or all the icons are missing. Please go ahead and right click on Start. Select Task Manager. Ensure you are on the Processes tab. Look for a process named Windows Explorer. Sometimes it's easily available here, but for others on a different view, you have to scroll down till the end to locate Windows Explorer. Please right click and choose Restart. Now your screen turns off for a few seconds and comes back automatically. Boo! It has fixed my issue. In some rare cases, the issue may repeat, especially after a restart. In that case, please follow the other solutions in this video. Let's now quickly look at how to unhide the taskbar, in case it's completely hidden. You may get it when you hover your mouse at the bottom of your screen. In case you want to disable this auto-hiding, please press Windows key and I together. This opens up settings. Please select personalization. Taskbar. Go to taskbar behaviors. Over here, please uncheck automatically hide the taskbar. It's also worth checking if you have enabled tablet mode, especially if you're on Windows 10. To do that please go to your notification area and disable tablet mode. Solution 2. Windows Updates. Please search and open Windows Updates. Please check for updates and install them all. Over here you should also ensure it's not waiting for restarts. Post your restart, please go to the same update screen. Ultimately, you should see a message that says you're up to date. Solution 3. Disable the internal graphics driver. Please right-click on Start. Select Device Manager. Expand Display Adapters. Over here please check if you have multiple graphics drivers. If you have only one, please skip the solution. I have two, one for my Intel internal graphics card, and another for the dedicated NVIDIA graphics card. If you have something similar to this, please go ahead and try disabling the internal graphics driver. Restart the PC and see if it has been fixed. Please remember to enable it back if this has not fixed your issue. Solution 4. Please update graphics drivers. This issue is related to your graphics card, so it's wise to update it or ensure it's up to date. There are several methods with which you can update your driver. I have given this link in the description, please refer to this to know what are the best ways to update your drivers. Solution 5. System Restore. If you have started getting it recently, then System Restore can help fix it. Please search and open Create a Restore Point. Ensure that you are in the System Protection tab. Select System Restore. Click Next. Please choose a recent and appropriate restore point from the list. From here please follow your on-screen instructions and complete the restore process. Please note, it may take more time to restore your PC, so please be prepared. Also your PC is expected to restart automatically as part of this restore process. The solutions that we've seen so far should work for most cases, but if your issue is so stubborn, then you should try these additional solutions. I hope it was helpful. Please do like the video and subscribe to our channel.
If you've any questions or thoughts, please feel free to leave them in the comments section below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in another helpful video.